Let me guess. He scarfed down five courses and had a hot young woman at his side. A young man, but the rest is accurate. He's a piece of work, all right. Well, I need him to get back to work. Jack needs UV lamps and Juan's dragging his feet. Hmm, that'll be tough. Juan barely listens to Jack, so he'll be an even tougher audience for you. He has his own men and power base, and he loves rubbing Jack's nose in that. And what can I do about that? Same as everyone else. Bribe him. He likes fine art, antiques, expensive shit from before the fall. When he sees something that used to be valuable, he can't stop himself. Zero self-control. Hmm. All right, where can I find something like that? I heard of an old Polish guy who lived in a penthouse by Liberation Passage. They say he was an art collector. You can try his place. You can only get there via paraglider. That's why there's a chance something is left. I'll be on the radio and guide you to him. What about you, huh? Going on a hunt? <laughs> no, a party. It's Danier's birthday, but you never know when a guest list will overlap with a hit list. Why don't you come and have a drink with us when you're done with one? I don't think Danier likes me. <laughs> he doesn't like anybody. We'll be in touch. Anybody else see that? Hey! We got a live one! What the heck? <laughs> you ain't leaving here alive, asshole. No container detected. Got it. Yeah. <sighs> Yeah, that's the board. 
for you, you piece of shit. You're mine now. Eat this fucker. You're all out. Until they make a new type of candle out of sheep back here, this is a game. Inhibitor container detected. Inhibitor container nearby. <laughs>
Assignments. Oh, something's off. Who do we have? <laughs> Can you hack it? <laughs>
our chances against the Renegades were pretty good. Canteen now? One, there's nothing left in here. Daniel said it's a virgin spot. Keep looking. Paintings, but no room for Jessica. <laughs> One romantic son of a bitch. Juan, I think I found his stash. A helicopter was coming for this guy. They sent everything to the roof. I'm headed there to look. Good luck. <laughs> ah, fuck. There aren't any paintings left. Everything's been destroyed. Hey, Luan, found our collector. But no sign of his collection. Luan? Hey, you there? Jesus, Aiden. I told you I was leaving. Okay, quick thing. Nothing here except for a bottle of whiskey and one of vodka. At least the whiskey's the good stuff. Juan likes a good whiskey. Maybe if you get him shit-faced, he'll loosen up, so to speak. So you still in the canteen? I saw him leaving. Seemed to be heading back to the ship. Probably to his quarters. Okay, I'll go there. And listen, that vodka, Daniel is a big fan. If you're planning to drop by, which you probably aren't, but if you really want to get to know this city, this is the way. Just saying.
Soldier? snack, isn't he, dear? Care to join? More the merrier. No, thank you. Ah, oh, have I embarrassed you? I'm sorry, I do have that effect on people. I'll wait for you, but make it quick. I must admit, I admire your persistence. Almost curious what you do after I send you packing, yet again. You'll regret it. Sixteen-year-old Highland single malt. Bottled a year before the pandemic broke out. I've read that one barrel of this stuff sold at auction for over half a million dollars. <sighs> what a sublime present.
to your health, handsome. What can I say? You broke down my defenses. So, you're still after those lamps. Did Matt tell you why he wanted them? And why he really wanted them? Yeah, to take control of the TV tower. Wait, he's serious? Is he crazy? Nobody tried that for over a decade. Matt wants to prepare to defend the city from the Butcher's coming attack. So, we should start building him a monument, right? Only problem? The Butcher isn't planning any attack. How do you know? I have my spies. Among the renegades as well. Since the end of the war, we have occupied the city center. While the Colonel squats in the dam. One push of a lever, and half the city will find itself under toxic water. The Colonel is not stupid. He knows war would be the end of everything. What about the UV lamps? Why does he want them, then? Jack is hiding something. For a while now, he's been ordering way more lamps than he could possibly need. And then some of those lamps always disappear. No accounting for them once we deliver. I'm not here for my health, Juan. I need the lamps to- To find out what happened to your sister. Right, Aiden? I told you I got my spies. Might be able to find something out about Waltz and your sister. Specifically about the GRE scientist you and Matt are trying to contact. I'd even say with my resources, I can find this person faster than Matt. I actually doubt he's able to find them at all. You're not using me to make a movie your own. I'm not your enemy, Aiden. It's a shame you don't see that. You'll get your lamps. You just gotta talk to Demolan. Who's he? He's my man. Sent him out to search for more lamps, but he hasn't checked in for a while. Where can I find him? Around here, last I heard from him. Find him. Then come back to me here afterward. You got it. Something else on your mind? Yeah. <sighs> 
Good job, man. You showed him. You're a goddamn superhero. <sighs> that beast had us trapped here. Wouldn't go away. It attacked us right as we got here. Mark got hurt pretty bad. We barely escaped and huddled up here. Finally went quiet not long ago. We thought that thing had wandered off. Next thing we hear is you banging on our barricade and then it all started again. I'm looking for Demolin. You guys seen him? Up top. Uh, come on, let's get you to a doctor. Get ready. This might hurt. Demolin, right? I'm Aiden. Not bad. Not bad. Aiden? Nice to meet you. Your skills are exceptional, and you don't look like a peacekeeper to me. So who are you? Juan told me to check up on you and the lamps. Ah, the lamps. Piece of cake, he says. No such luck. We found a few, but it wasn't what you would call a bountiful harvest. And it came at great cost. The corporal killed by the beast outside has a brother in the unit. He will be devastated. He is at present with a squad down south on the lower dam promenade. They have not reported in. That doesn't sound good. We need to find him. The boy's mother lost her husband in a dark zone just last week. Now, a son. If her other son were to perish, it would be too much for any mother to bear. I'll try to find him. Okay. The boy's name is Sebastian. The islands are a dangerous area. Worse since the renegades overran them. Remember, the boy's name is Sebastian. Great. Supply are quite a helpless bunch, it seems. What did you expect? There were ordinary people before the fall. Craftsmen, teachers, gardeners, not fighters. Yeah! <laughs> 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 
renegades. Knew of them. Again? That's crazy. It has to be part of something the Butcher and Waltz are brewing. But why now? Just give me a sign you're alive! <laughs> Found your men. Um, some of them, at least. I'm sorry to say, they're dead. Aiden? You sure? How many? Two bodies, both quite dead. The squad had five men. There are three others. There's still hope. Okay, I'll look for them. Berserk. It's crazy, I know. Something must have happened to them. They used to be regular soldiers, at least most of them. But now they're more like living virals. They're mad. They kill everyone in their path. Like mad? What do you mean? They say Williams treats them like animals, and they go wild. Oh, the butcher is crazy, like they say. Crazy and unpredictable. Found him. Look! Another transfer! You're that thing! Get him! Get him!
Relax. A Demolin sent me. Hey, you guys all right? Me? Yeah. Sebastian, not so much. I'm sure I'll be fine. But I was sent here for the lamps. Where are they? After we drove off the Renegades, we reached the building. To get in, we strung some ropes across from the next roof. And that's when the Renegades attacked again. And the lamps? They're still on the landing pad on the roof. The military hit them well, made sure no one could see them from above. Seba only saw them from the next building, through binoculars. But we didn't get a chance to finish securing the ropes. Is there any other way to get there? You could go through the building, but like I said, wall-to-wall -wall biters. I gotcha. I'll try the rope. You'd have to be a spider to climb in. And it's swarming with renegades outside. I like taking chances. Take this, contact Emelyn, and tell him what happened here. I'll go get those lamps.
I'm fine, but I took a fall. The lamps are busted in this one. Gotta take care of that thing up top and check the other container. Admit it. Juan's your type. What? I... Luan, get lost. Inhibitor container detected. <laughs> Hey, Demolin, got your lamps. A dozen crates, maybe more. All untouched. Merci, Aiden. You did your job well. Unfortunately, Sebastian didn't make it. I'm sorry to hear that. Poor boy. I so wanted to show him my father's shop. There's too much for me to carry on my own, and no way I'd make it through the infected while loaded down. The boys can get to the roof and manage the lamps themselves. They won. We secured the lamps, but the squad hit a snag when the renegades... Shh. Not over the radio. Come to my quarters on the ship.
Mission accomplished. Shh. Do you know what that is, Aiden? Uh, it looks like uh, mouse turds, buckshot. Dios, que triste. These are eggs, Aiden. You have some really small chickens. Fish eggs. Belugas, to be exact. Straight from the Caspian Sea. Dissolving on your tongue, you taste the waves of a black, deep sea in a faraway land. The world is full of beautiful things, beautiful sensations. Pretty boys and pretty girls. But humorless grunts don't notice that. What do you mean? You can't be obsessed with political machinations and enjoy the beauty of life at the same time. Who do you mean? The Jack Mats and Aidens of the world. Such a shame you picked the wrong team. Only team I'm on is my own. Sounds lonely. I'm not a fan of loneliness, you see. Did Mad reveal to you what he'll do with those lamps in a place without power? And how he plans to carry out this suicidal mission? As I thought, take this and call him. Tell him the lamps will be delivered to the TV station. Matt, the lamps are ready. Got it, Ada. Good work. I hope Juan didn't give you any trouble. Juan said that the TV station has no power. What good are these lamps to us if we can't turn them on? Juan's just fucking around. Don't worry about that. Aiden, it's time we meet and talk about how to take that damn antenna. Wait for my signal. Roger. <sighs> that. Well, I hope you like taking orders, Aiden. Because Jack loves giving them. Stay close to your radio. You'll be informed of the meeting shortly. Take care of these two for me, will you? to play, sweet thing. 